this video we're going to have a look at competitions. There are two basic types of competition in nominations program. There's automatic ones and not automatic. So we're going to create a new event with the event wizard, uh, event utility, which is a bit quicker than the wizard and it has a bit more uh, visual presentation of things. So there we have a very simple event, 100 targets, one, four rounds, one course. We're going to import some shooters as we've done several times before. with scores. Now go to set up competitions. We can now see the automatic competitions double A, A, B and so on. Double A grade looks like this. It has a high gun shoot off. And can have handicap if you wish or none. You can adjust the number of prize winners. I'll set it down to one. And notice that it's now changed up there to 1. Um, A grade and B grade are shown in yellow. And A grade is selected. Its configuration is pretty much the same as we saw for double A. So there are two people tied for third in this case. So we'll have a look at getting a shoot-off scorecard. And this is using the Microsoft Print 2 PDF driver. So there's our two shooters, there's the score card. Pretty simple stuff. So the scores come back, find Aiden's got what 20, Donato got 18. That resolves the ties. We hit the complete A grade competition to finish that off and it immediately selects B grade which has also got a tie for first position. This time we'll just use the arrow keys to move the people into the correct order and won't set any shoot off scores. Having done that all competitions have been processed and we can hit OK and close the event. database gets synchronised, uploads. Uh, if you've got some suggestions to fix or improve the program, now's your time to say. We'll delete that event, create another one, and I'll show you how to add some non-automatic competitions. Again, we'll create a new event. This time we'll make it a four grade competition, double A, A, B and C. If we have a look at the grade and category competitions, we see that there are three winners for each of double A, A, B and C and none for any of the others. It's also a ticked category competition. So if we say OK to that, we will build an event with just those four grades. Just import those shooters again. And this one will take a little while because I forgot to turn off live scores updating for this one, so bear with me. added and there they are. Okay notice we've got live scores active there which was probably not necessary but doesn't matter. Again we'll reset competitions but notice there is only the four of them this time. 
um, this is a kind of setup that we use at Rocky Gully quite regularly. Okay, we'll add a new competition and we'll make it a door prize. It's something a little bit different. All shooters chosen at random. No shoot off, not eliminated. Hit the OK button. And now we have a door prize competition. We'll add another one. Two door prizes. We'll call this one door prize B. Just to distinguish them. Same setup details. OK. Door prize. We can swap our positions around. So B will now display before A, or one without a prize. Process that, and it picks a shooter at random. Hit complete, and that's done. We do the same for the other door prize. Another random shooter. Done. Now we need to set up the, or complete the automatic things. We'll just have a look at the scorecard. It's got uh, the three shooters in it. We saw before. Nothing terribly surprising about that. Now let's just put in some shoot off scores. 20, 19, or 21, and 22. Okay. Complete that competition and we'll put in some oh, we'll have a look at scorecard for B grade as well once again nothing terribly unusual about that enter the shoot off scores 19 and 18 and then complete all competitions in our process and we can click OK and close the event. You don't have to close it at this stage but it's usually what you need to do anyway. Once again you get a chance to send any suggestions. Let's have a look at the prize winners because normally after an event you have to have some presentations hand out the prizes. So here we go, so door prize B comes before the door prize as we change that order. Then you've got the four grades. I'm sure you've all seen those kinds of reports before. Once again, we'll just delete that event. This time you'll notice there we go, stunned.